Hey everyone, so I was tagged by the lovely Shell Barbie to do a tag video and it's the, um, I think it's the winter favourites tag. It was a summer tag, what's your like summer favourite tag, but because it's colder here at the moment, it's not too bad. It's been really, really cold, not to the point that it's snowing or anything, but we're going to do the winter favourites tag. So I was tagged by um, Shell Barbie to do this and yeah, so I'm really excited about doing this. So if you want to see what my winter favourites are, please keep watching. Okay, so to start off um, this tag, the first question is favourite lip product. Okay, so I'm guessing this is between is something that, because it's cold here at the moment, I've chosen two because I really like these two and I've been using them the past few weeks. So, yeah. So the first one is my favourite lip product is this um, Napoleon Purtis Luminous Lip Shine or something in the Tangerine Slice and it is this gorgeous coral. You might be able to read it. There you go, Tangerine Slice. And it's this gorgeous corally goldy colour. It's got these gold reflex in it. And I really like that because it's not too sticky or, yeah, horrible on your lips. Like some, like in winter, because it's so cold outside, your lips get so chapped and yucky. And Yeah, so, and so the next one is, I just got this like a couple of weeks ago, but I'm a huge fan of any sort of lip balm. I think I've gone, this winter, I've gone through three or four lip balms, like the tubes of lip balms. I use them up like crazy and it's one product that I always run out of. So, but this one I'm trying to hold back because this is a limited edition sort of thing. And it was a collab between Boost Juice and um, Balloon Cosmetics. They came out with these lip balms. And I got Berry Bang, and seriously, this smells like um, raspberry jelly and cream. It smells so, so yummy, and it tastes really good on your lips too. But I'm trying to hold back on this because it's really good. And I got this a couple of weeks ago when I went to Sydney, and I bought this with my friend Tara and um, Shelly, Michelle, um, from Cosmetic Cupcake and Keeping Up With Me blog um and yeah so I got one of these and I'm so pleased that I did because I really 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 like it so that's that one now what's the next question I think it might be favorite blush okay so I'm going to combine this question with the fifth question because you'll know what that is shortly when I get up to it my favourite blush, I don't really have a favourite blush because I don't, I'm not a really big blush fan wearer. I don't wear blush that much because I feel like my cheeks are like really rosy and I just don't like that. But I like to contour my face and I really swear by this MAC blush in golden and I've hit pan on it as you can see. And it is the perfect tone. It's got these little iridescent sparkles in it. And um, I've had this forever and ever and ever. And, yeah, I absolutely adore it. So, as you can see, I think I've had this for two years. And I use this every single day except for today because I don't have any makeup on. But, oh, well. But, yeah, I use this to contour my face and just to add a bit of colour to my cheeks. And... Yeah, I'm not a really big blush wearer, so, oh well. Okay, so moving on to the next question, whatever that may be. Let me find it. Um, okay, this one's a funny one because obviously I can't wear this product. Okay, so number three, nail polish. Well, I don't can't wear nail polish, so I'm going to skip that question. <laughs> Obviously. Okay. Um, number four, liquid face product. Okay, so my favourite li liquid face product of the moment 
would seriously have to be my top, top, top favourite ever to be worn. And sorry, it's a little bit dirty because it goes everywhere. And it's the BB cream. Um, super blemish balm. And it's the VIP, VIP gold collection. And yes, there it is. I really like this and it just makes my skin feel amazing and gives me a lot of coverage and I swear by this and if you don't like it, too bad. But I absolutely, absolutely swear by BB creams for anybody, well not anybody, it's up to you if you like them or if you don't like them but yeah. I really, 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 really love this BB cream. It's so moisturising on my skin and it doesn't get flaky on my dry spots. So I have really dry skin and it doesn't get flaky. It doesn't irritate my skin. It's just my favourite, favourite ever. Okay, moving on. Okay, so number five, favourite face, face powder face product. Um... Um, it would definitely have to be my my bronzer because I go all over my face with that and that sets my BB cream sometimes. But I also have one here and I don't have the lid to it because I'm lazy and I don't put lid on, lids on my stuff. But it's this concealer, but it's a powder form. I don't know if you can see that. But it is a... Um, it's in blonde and it's mineral cover up and it's by Lily Lolo Mineral Foundation. Like it comes in a, like, I used to use Lily Lolo Foundation powder minerals all the time and I swap in between that every now and again. But since I found BB cream, I don't do that. But yeah, this is like a um, concealer but in a powder form and oh my God, this covers everything everything i just put this under my eyes and on my nose and on my little spots and you can't even see it it's so so good so that's really good and you can just brush this all over your face really lightly with a powder brush and it will cover just put a light sheer like matte finish over your face so lily lolo cover up powder is really really good okay moving on Number so, uh, number six, hair product. Okay, my number one favourite hair product is this, um, it's NARC, um, and there, and it's like a leave-in conditioner with argon oil in it, and um, this is like my third or fourth bottle, like, tube of this and yeah it's like a leave-in conditioner and it just helps it's like a heat protectant and yeah Narx Armos Armos and therapy with argon oil so yeah I put this in my hair before or after I've washed my hair and it just leaves my hair feeling shiny and it smells really really gorgeous I really like it and if you have any knots in your hair as well, it really helps by putting this in before you brush in because it just gets rid of the knots. It's like a miracle thing. It's like so, so good. And you can get this at, I get this at my local hair salon and it's $21 for this size. So it's pretty pricey, but it's well worth it. And it locks your color in as well. So if you're worried about colour leakage, if your colour's going to leak, because I've got purple in my hair, as you can probably see there. Um, if you're worried about your colour leaking onto your face or anything, this will lock it in as well. So, And you can straighten, whoops, <laughs> straighten your hair with it and it will not burn your ends or anything like that. Sit over there. Okay. Um, eye product. I'm not sure what this means, whether it means an eye cream. If it means an eye cream, I don't use an eye cream. I should, but I can't find the right one. 
But if you're talking about an eye primer, I really, 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 you would know this anyway, like the Urban Decay Primer Potion, and I have the biggest eyes. Now I got this from Sephora, and I love this because it locks your eyeshadow in and keeps it on and doesn't let it run, and oh, it's just marvellous. Okay, so that's my favourite eye primer, but I don't have an eye cream. Okay, body product. Um, okay, so I don't usually really use any creams on my body because of my EB, but if I'm using a hand cream, it definitely has to be the more. Now, this is worn off, the writing has worn off, but it's in the green tube, as you can see, no writing. <laughs> And it's the hand cream with, um, it's basil and grapeseed. And this is the most divine smelling hand cream I've ever, ever used. And I swear by this. It's really, really rich and creamy and it hydrates your hand, skin on your hands. And I really, really recommend this product. I love it. And yeah, so... I really like that for a body product. It smells so good, guys. You just don't know how good it smells. Okay, favorite fashion accessory. Obviously, I'm a big freak with headbands. Any sort of, any sort of headband or anything. And I've got two of my favorites here. So there's this one. I really, really like this because it's like a big purple gerber flower and I think I got this from the ladybugs house on Facebook she hand makes these so I got that one I really like that one but this is my next top favorite and there's hair on it and it's this gorgeous you've seen me wear this before I'm pretty sure and it's this gorgeous headband and it looks like that I love, love this headband. It's gorgeous. And yeah, I, I got this from Diva in New Zealand when I went a couple, I think it was not last year, the year before, I can't remember. And it was like only $5 or something. And I wear this all the time when I'm going out. And I always get compliments on this headband. And this is my favorite accessory ever. So yeah, headbands. Um, and lucky last, clothing piece. Um, definitely a scarf. I didn't bring one over. I've got like heaps, but I forgot to bring it. <laughs> but I really like scarves or, um, little jackets like these, like these light fitted, snug fitted bolero sort of things. I can't remember what you call it. Cardigans? Duh, Stevie. Um, but yeah, I really like them. So that was my winter tag, favorite winter tag video. I really hope you uh, hope you liked it, and I will talk to you all later. And I tag you to do this. So leave a video response to this video, and I would be so happy to watch it. Okay, everyone, I'll talk to you all later, and thanks for watching. Bye.